my hair is giving major political wife realness. Yes. My, my husband is running for some kind of office <laughs> and I'm here to wave and smile. and I'm so excited about this project. Let's say it's Pinterest inspired because I've seen it all over Pinterest. I've even seen a couple of DIY videos on YouTube and I thought right now was the perfect time for me to give this plastic cup chandelier project a try. For this project you're going to need 50 cups, a 50 count string of Christmas lights, and a stapler with a lot of extra staples. To start this project, you have to drill a hole in every single one of your 50 cups. Now this project is really made in two separate pieces, so start by separating your cups, 25 and 25. Put a set of 25 aside, and let's just start with the first 25. Does that make sense? We're gonna st what are, how do you say this? And we're gonna make the first half, and then we'll make the second half, and then we'll put them together. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. First, take 12 cups, Staple them together. This is going to create your first layer. Now for the second layer. That's going to be nine cups. Now make sure you're really getting good in there with the staples and stapling it so that it's all nice and secure. So make sure that for this project you have extra staples on standby because the staples are the key to this project. You want to get in and staple these cups wherever you can just to make sure that this thing is really secure and won't fall apart on you. Now take your last four cups and create a layer at the top, really closing in that hole. Time to add in the light. And then you're gonna repeat it. Once you have the two halves done, you're just gonna simply put them together and staple it closed. I have to admit, I was a little nervous about this project when I first started, just because, you know, Pinterest lies. But this actually ended up being a project that was easy, and I completed, and it looks really fantastic. Now, you know I wanted me a pink one of these, right? So I found these pink plastic cups at the grocery store, and I thought, well, this is perfect. But turns out it was less than perfect. Here's a really important DIY tip that I learned that I'm now telling you guys that if you make this project yourself, you will just cut out all the confusion. When you're picking out your cups, they have to be shatter proof, okay? You see these cute, adorable pink ones I got were not shatter proof. And so anytime I tried to drill a hole or staple them, they broke into a million pieces. But I was not just gonna let the idea of a cute, pink chandelier go out the window, okay? I ended up using my clear cups and just getting pink lights, which also gave the illusion of a pink chandelier. So there you guys go. I hope you enjoyed this easy, easy project. I love it because it's like the perfect oversized ornament for the holidays. And then once you're done, it becomes this sort of swag lamp that you can hang over your bar and it'll be with you through the entire year. Right? Look at hair, right? Yeah. I need to wrap this up. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up, and I'll see you guys next time.